what's good guys everyday music aka edm here now i want to talk about section boys and what the hell actually happened to their careers now if you guys actually forgot section boys were the next big thing they were the shit like they were on the same level as storms here at one point so how did they suddenly lose steam now one thing i wanted to point out was during 2014 their first big anthem was delete my number and during this time they created a uk trap sound that did really pop off until they burst onto the scene hits like no rules and my favorite song banter cemented their status in the uk scene now 2015 was their year with their two biggest songs trapping ain't dead and lock off being released that same year not to mention drake came out with them for their tour that year so what actually happened i feel the biggest thing that began to slow section boys down was the fact the time they started popping off with their chat wave drill came through and started to take over six seven started taken off the scene followed by Harlem and 410 but Stormzy and Krypton Conan were able to go clear but why not them? Well Stormzy and most definitely Krypton Conan went clear because they were able to transition their sound from trap, grime to commercial music while Section Boys continued to produce that underground sound. I think they failed to realise that if you don't go commercial and tweak and evolve your sound your career will never elevate to where you want it to go. We've seen it with Dave, Heady One, Fredo, j Haas, even Central C adapt their music and progress with their career hopefully section boys or as they're now called smoke boys are able to get their career moving again what do you think of their career so far hope you enjoyed don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you again next time